This week we highlight another life well lived. Most baseball fans will tell you Ted Williams was the greatest hitter who ever lived. But he was no match for the greatest pitcher ever to stand on a softball mound. Joan Joyce was born and raised in Waterbury, Connecticut, the daughter of factory workers. An athletic prodigy, Joyce was recruited at the age of 13 to play for the nearby Raybestos Breakettes, a women's fast-pitch softball team named for a local company that still makes brake linings for cars and trucks. Throwing a nearly unhittable ball, the kid soon became a legend. Over 19 seasons on the team with a break for college, Joyce won 753 games, threw 150 no-hitters, tossed 50 perfect games, and led the Breakettes to the Women's Softball World Championship. Her most famous performances came, though, against men, and not just any men. During a 1961 exhibition game, Joyce struck out the great Ted Williams who was reported when asked to name the toughest pitcher he ever faced to have said a teenage girl in Connecticut. In 1978, Joyce faced Hank Aaron, then baseball's all-time home run king. She struck him out, too. A phenom in volleyball, basketball, and bowling as well, Joyce took up golf at the age of 35. Two years later, she qualified for the LPGA Tour, where she competed for 19 years. Inducted into the International Women's Sports Hall of Fame in 1989, Joyce coached softball for 28 years at Florida Atlantic University, where she also led the golf team. As Hank Aaron said simply after striking out against Joyce, she was something else. I just happened to be lucky from a place that you know, had those opportunities, and I was gifted enough to be able to do it. Joan Joyce, one of the greatest athletes of all time, died last weekend in Boca Raton, Florida. She was 81 years old. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.